Hello Retro Gaming Maniacs and welcome to another episode of Press Play on Retro Gaming. Oh, Maniac. Enjoy my channel and have fun. Hello Retro Gaming Maniacs, nice that you've tuned into another episode of Press Play on Tape, where I try to load original tapes into my dataset, into my Commodore 64. And this time I take a look at the game The Pyramid, which I have here. And um, yeah, I will uh, take out the cassette and oh! <laughs> what I see here is um, normally you have a, a small, a, a little um, transparent uh, plastic window here and this is missing here on this tape. Okay, I hope the tape loads anyway. So let's put this one into the data set. And then let's try to load it. Okay, with the common shift run stop. Counter is set to zero. Okay, and then let's try to load it. Hopefully it starts. There's nothing more on the inside, but we have some text on the outside and that, uh, well, that I can read it, I have to change my glasses because the other ones I wear uh, are for the uh, PC distance only and not for the normal reading distance. But I wait a moment uh, until I... Ah, yeah, found pyramid. Okay, that looks promising. So, and while this one loads, hopefully, uh, let's read what we have here. The Pyramid is an arcade-style game which has very adventure, a very adventurous feel. The Pyramid contains 120 chambers of 15 levels. In order to get from one chamber to another, you must fight off the in indeed genius aliens to collect an energized crystal which will neutralize the force field guarding the two exits. Ah, seems to be a rather a short, short loading time for that. Hopefully it starts then. Yeah, there we have it already it seems. And the tape is... Ah, now the tape is still running through. Ah, please wait, the pyramid is loading. Yeah, reading would be a good idea then. Uh, yes, the pyramid is defended by a total of 120 different beautifully animated aliens, more than any other video game in history. Okay, one for every chamber and each with a unique attack pattern. They manifest themselves in the most amazingly diverse and uh, peculiar forms, from the squirting soda siphons to the extraterrestrial tweezers and a whole host of entities uh, defying rational description. You will have great fun inventing your own nicknames. <laughs> You proceed to explore the pyramid from top to bottom with the difficulty increasing with the depth of level as attack patterns get more complex and the aliens become intelligent. Depending on the choice of exit from each chamber, you are likely to have a different game every time you play. Um, apart from the challenge of trying to achieve the highest score possible, the pyramid contains a number puzzle to solve. The more chambers you successfully visit, the more information is gathered to enable you to unravel the secret numbers of the pyramid. The manned craft shown in the pyramid above is your exploratory capsule and is a true representation of the on-screen graphics. 1984 Fantasy Software Limited. And uh, I already know the pyramid. I did a German video of that recently, but uh, it was on another tape together with uh, some others. Uh, it it was called called uh, the Thriller Gamepad or pack or also something. And uh, yeah, uh, looking through my tape collection, 
Um, yeah, I saw that I have the game also uh, standing uh, as a standalone version. Uh, as yeah, now I try to load and hopefully it will load and it will start. That would be cool uh, because it's a real nice arcade style game and I really love to play it from time to time. And uh, I got to know recently that there all, uh, also is a, a ZX Spectrum version and perhaps I will uh, put the ZX Spectrum version uh, behind this one uh, in the same video so that you have a comparison between the two, the C64 and the ZX Spectrum version. And yeah, let's see but uh, yeah first it should load at all before we can start uh, playing <laughs> yeah let's see how long we have to wait here yeah at the moment I hear uh, the data transfer seems to work yeah and then we will see what happens if it runs I still have to be careful with my kind of movements because uh, uh, it's uh, the time where I record this video is um, three and a half weeks after my shoulder surgery and uh, yeah I have to be a bit careful uh, I cannot uh, I'm not allowed to lift any heavy weight with my right arm so most of the time I have to work with, with my left one. And I really wish that the tape will load. And there are so many uh, more tapes I have in my collection um, that, that are waiting for being tested and discovered. Then uh, many of the tapes, uh, tapes I bought on the last retro fairs, I only bought because uh, of the look of its cover. Uh, and many of them I didn't know before or don't know yet uh, some of them I, I've read what uh, was standing on the uh, cassette inlay and uh, yeah if it sounds as if it's a shoot em up or so then uh, I've picked it up because I really like shoot em up games on the C64 uh, or, or the genre uh, in general uh, yeah and uh, here uh, I first haven't uh, realized uh, that is uh, that this is a game I already know and I already have on another tape um, but I really love playing this and uh, as I uh, haven't done an English version of that uh, now I try to load this this is the first loading time uh, attempt uh, from this tape and it still seems to load and hopefully it will run then. This would be really cool. Have to wait a little bit, I think. Yeah, now we have eight minutes loading time. And perhaps, ah, there we have it. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted to uh, wanted to suggest to stop uh, the recording and come back when the game is loaded and just then it started. Uh, so let's change my glasses and let's put my headphone on and hopefully I can yes joystick part 2 and there I have installed my ghosty arcada and uh, yeah get back a little bit. Ah, ah sitting comfortable hopefully and push one joystick selected good luck and there we have it starting at the top and and there am i in action i, I can shoot and uh, so i have to avoid all these uh, nesties here and have to collect the uh, what was happening ah now i have released the game somehow and made it to level two okay so then start uh, 
What do these birds do? Are they eating something? Ah, let's try to get the crystal here. So now I'm green, so I hope I have the crystal aboard. Ah, and somehow I have released it, but that wasn't planned. So let's try to get this one. Why couldn't I move? Ah, and um, what I've noticed, when they touch me, um, I'm losing energy. Huh? Yeah, this is a really nice game. And uh, what I love is uh, the diversity of enemies. Ah, this is a... F This is just level 2, and it's already hard. So now let's try. Yes, and uh, it seems that uh, I need two crystals now. Uh, why? I have to find out from which side I have to capture the diamond. Ah, and if it hits another uh, sprite, then uh, it also vanishes. Ah, fuck. So let's see how deep I can dive into the pyramid to its bottom. Now I have it. And I like to keep it. Uh, go away! Some of them seem to follow me. Yeah, this is really a hard task. Released. So now I only had to need to go to the exit. Hopefully without getting touched by the enemies. Okay, level three now. Let's go. Let's uh, go. Wow. Some strange olds. Yeah, I don't know what happens then. Oh! Okay. So, the second one also, uh, it seems I need to get to the left. Oh, went through it. Okay. Chamber number five is coming up. Ah, clocks. <laughs> I really love this. And the cool thing is the tape works. That's great. Ah. And it seems that I have to shoot the crystal uh, once or twice and then it's uh, changing its color to this greenish. And then I can... Normally, I should be able to collect it <laughs> if there isn't another damn sprite uh, disturbing me uh, <laughs> in action. <laughs> ah, fuck. Yeah, there's uh, lots of action here in the game, lots of sprites. Okay, collected, and now I have to... Ah, shit! Well, I would say uh, to make it safely to the exit. Ah, damn. Yes. Okay, perhaps now. Drop it. Huh? Do I need three games this time? <gasps> No! Sometimes I just lose uh, the, the game. Ah. And then, uh, mostly in the uh, wrong moment, uh, the game hits a sprite and then it, uh, it uh, vanishes. Okay, so let's give it another try now. And hopefully... The entrance is open, yes. 
Huh, that was hard. Yeah. Zium, zium, all televisions. Yeah. Okay, then that was the problem again. Okay, this time release the game carefully and without blah, without problems. Hmm. Seems it's okay when it's uh, any other color color than white. Hmm. Yeah, and then I can pick it up. Huh? Okay, so it seems you need more and more crystals uh, to get to the exit. I really have to, to check out if I'm losing energy when I touch the gem. Or if it's reloaded then. 9-9, nine, nine, okay. It's some huge crabs. Okay, so this time I could pick it up without problems, but uh, contact with an enemy and then I'm losing my uh, game. Wow, lots of action here. But I really love the game. This is, this is so much fun. Ah! Oh. Uh. <laughs> oh, fuck! <gasps> ah, yeah, oh, just picked it up. No! So bad. Hmm, perhaps I should try this side again. Uh, uh. So in the end, it hopefully doesn't matter. Yeah, I'm... I'm. It seems I'm not allowed to touch... Ah, fuck! The game, uh, if it's white. Eh, uh, what happened? Yeah. Okay. So let's try to go out on the left side. In the end... Ah, shit. There's so much action here. Unbelievable. What's going on here? Okay. Ah, damn. This is really damn hard. Ah, let me alone. Fucking craps. Crab soup. Okay. <laughs> Hopefully I can make it to the exit now. Yes. Oh. <laughs> oh man, this is hard. What is this? I I don't fucking know. No, fuck. <laughs> Some of them are really chasing me. And no crystals. Oh my god. Yeah, they are really... Uh, they are really going after me here. Yeah, it seems I have to shoot several times at the crystal. And then it's harmless to me. And otherwise, uh, yeah, I get hold and I'm losing energy then. Wow, this is really getting tough now will i ever make it to the ground oh. this is really hard but this is it's also great yes well first time oh. no <laughs> You see, there's lots going on here. Too much. Okay, yeah, it seems you need uh, three crystals to make it to the exit. And uh, this is really hard. So again, let's try to get out here. Shit! Is this possible? Oh, this is unbelievable. So now... 
Yes, okay, Level 8, done. Great. Ne? Level 9, ne, ah, ah, it says, this is Level 8, okay. The good thing is you start, you're starting every level with a uh, 10,000 energy, it seems. And I really love that. It's hard, but it's really, it's awesome. And uh, I really wonder how the ZX Spectrum version will look like and how it will play. I definitely will try this out later on and will put this behind this gameplay video here. Yeah, this is really awesome. Ah. Oh. And uh, it reminds me a slightly little bit of jetpack. Where you also have to collect parts, yeah, parts from your, for your rocket. And then, uh, oh, <laughs> by accident. Yes, drop this by accident into the exit. <laughs> cool. Hey, got really far in, but oh, now they are really fast. And I'm so slow. I fear that I uh, will not get much farther now. Oh, there's so much action. This is nearly impossible. Okay, dropped one. Ugh, lost the other one. Oh, it's so hard to get one of these gems without getting caught by the... Oh, really annoying. They are, they are getting uh, more and more nasty. Fuck. Ah, P stands for power. Okay. Is it game over then? Yes, you have only this one life. Okay. New high score. Press fire to play. Um, I definitely will give this one another go. And uh, this time, I uh, if you liked uh, high score code. Okay, that's interesting. So I think if you write this down, can you enter the code and then restart from there? Or what does it mean? Yeah, whatsoever. I give this one um, another try and then uh, now I try to go um, on the left side to see, hopefully to see some other sprites. Yeah, you're about to enter chamber one. So uh, you cannot um, uh, enter a code here as it seems. So uh, this is uh, always the same. Yeah, and this time I try to go to the left side. Yep. So that we see some other sprites and some other levels. Yeah, I, s I still have to look. P stands for power. Okay, and S, I think it's time. Hmm, some elephant -y. Uh, yeah, it looks like elephant heads. <laughs> this is really weird. Okay, so I don't lose power when I collect the gem. Uh, and somehow I have... Ah. Hmm. So I try to go out here. I try to go out on the left side. I really try to go. Oh, fuck. Nah. Oh, fuck. <laughs> uh, this is just level two, but it's already uh, rather hard. So, yeah. So it seems you have to. No. Okay. Entrance still not open. Yeah, you have to shoot the game uh, until it's greenish. 
Uh, nah. So this is another difficulty then. To avoid all the nesties. And at the same time to collect and hopefully don't lose your gem because by uh, pushing the stick down and holding the fire button the gem is released i just found out nah so that's another difficulty here ah. Yeah, now, oh, finally, that was a hard fight to get to the exit. And now we see some other sprites again. So every game differs a bit uh, and depending on which exit you choose. And again, I try to go out on the left side. Hopefully, yep. Ah. Okay, so here again I need three. Ah, shit! Yeah, if the game isn't green, uh, then you uh, uh, will be hold and cannot move for a short while. Yeah, green is, uh, is uh, safe. So let's go out here and then the next way is um, doesn't matter if I go to the left or to the right. Oh, radio, radio Gaga. I guess they got Gaga, these radios here. <laughs> no games inside. Ah, okay. Let's choose the way that is closer to the exit. Ah. Okay. Yeah, one left, so you really need three ones to reach the exit. And hopefully I can make it to... Ha! <laughs> yes. And now again, I think... Yeah, I can try to go out on the left side. What is this? I have no plan what this might be. But what I can say is, this is difficult. Ah! Let's be quick. Yes. And then again. Nah, nah. Yep. So, one left. To go out. On the left. <laughs> Hopefully, without getting caught. Huh? Do I need four this time? Ah, so it seems uh, the lower you get, the more games you need. Okay. So and this time again, I think it doesn't matter which trumpets. Oh, damn. <laughs> what a welcome here. Just coming out and then just get caught. Ah, uh, one. Ah! Uh, and this is really not easy. But I can highly recommend uh, testing this out for yourself. And I'm really looking forward to the ZX Spectrum version later on. Ah! Oh. Man, this is hard. Uh. <laughs> really lots of action here. Oh man, so much going on here on screen. This is, this is, wow. And then uh, only 36 energy left. Aha. This is nearly an uh, uh No. I guess I will be ga game over soon. Nah. Park. Eh. 
No, only oh, 12 left. Yeah, I see the end is near. Oh my god. Now, I guess I have no chance anymore. Bam. That was it. Oh man, that's hard. <laughs> but I love it. This is awesome. This is really awesome. What a great game. Uh, I can highly remake uh, re <laughs> re <make a> <laughs> I can highly re recommend trying this out. This is uh, lots of fun. And uh, yeah, I uh, will soon switch over to the ZX Spectrum version and we will see that then coming after this one. So till uh, yeah, till then. <laughs>